Hello everyone and welcome to my Sister Wife Studio YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. David Woolley and Christine Brown are now legally wed. Additionally, it appears that the star of TLC's Sister Wives used her wedding as an occasion to publicly humiliate her ex-sister wife, Mary. What did Christine do exactly? For more information, keep reading. Since fans learned that Christine Brown wed on Saturday, information about her wedding is starting to emerge. What was the guest list like? Was one of the most frequent queries from Sister Wives viewers. Fans were particularly curious to know if Cody Brown or any of Christine's prior sister wives were present. Naturally, Janelle Brown was listed as a guest. Despite Janelle and Christine's breakup with Cody Brown, they are still close friends. Janelle is still Christine's sister wife, and Christine has explicitly stated to David that they are a unit. Fans were also not overly shocked that Cody and Robin skipped the wedding. Attending the wedding wasn't really necessary for Cody Brown. Christine also made it plain that she was not romantically involved with Robin. Similarly, she simply had no desire in beginning one. Christine insisted she wanted to preserve her relationships the way they were as she exited the room and away from Cody. Regrettably, Mary Brown also skipped the wedding. Some followers believe Christine's decision to leave her off the guest list was a slap in the face. Others, however, draw attention to the fact that Mary Brown's brother passed away just two days before the ceremony. Fans suspect that Mary might have been invited to the wedding but was unable to attend. However, Cody Brown's first spouse made it apparent that she wasn't disappointed about missing the wedding. Instead, she uploaded videos of herself having fun with pals and riding a tractor. Surprisingly, Audrey Chris and Liam Brown, who is the kid of Mary Brown, attended the wedding. Fans were left with severe questions in light of Gwendolyn Brown's confirmation that Leon was severing ties with the family. Fans also didn't believe Leon and Christine were really close. Furthermore, several fans believed Mary was invited because Leon attended the wedding. Therefore, the issue that arises is, did Mary really smack Christine in the face by canceling? Viewers of Sister Wives are already speculating about whether the wedding of Christine Brown and David Woolley, which took place over the weekend, will be shown even though the dust has just settled. In a stunning outdoor ceremony performed at the Red Cliffs Lodge in Moab, Utah, on Saturday, October 7, Christine and her soulmate were legally declared to be husband and wife, according to Monsters and Critics. On Instagram, Christine gushed over the fairy tale wedding, and Sister Wives viewers expressed their joy for the TLC actress. Additionally, people published several images from the historic event, including one of Christine and her previous sister wife turned BFF, Janelle Brown, who was present at the wedding. Christine's admirers are eager to see whether they will be able to witness Christine and David say, I do on television now that she has entirely cut her connections with her ex-husband, Cody Brown, and the polygamy community. A Sister Wives fan posted a picture from a webcam that was obviously set up for Christine and David's wedding on Reddit. Christine and David were photographed standing next to their efficient in front of their wedding arbor overlooking a lake. Beyond their wooden platform, where their guests were seated, there were many camera operators in plain view. Naturally, this prompted followers of Sister Wives to speculate in the comments section that Christine and David's wedding may in fact be featured in a future episode of the show. I had no idea the wedding had a webcam, but I could certainly see a big crane camera or something in addition to the three, so I guess it's going to be on TLC later. A different Redditor stated that their mother-in-law attended Christine's wedding and that there was a section you could sit in where you wouldn't be filmed so I'm like 90% sure it will be on TLC. My Kelty Padron, who starred in the Sister Wives series, and her husband Tony frequently post new videos and family updates on her Patreon page. 
They organize watch parties for the reality series there and answer questions from the audience. My Kelty admitted she was never paid for her work on the show during one of the episodes. Who won and lost money seems to be a recurring problem for TLC reality kids. My Kelty and Tony Padron provided information on sister wives in a video they made for their Patreon channel. My Kelty stated she never received payment while filming the 18 seasons of the TLC series during this Q and a session. Usually, episodes of TLC shows with weddings and new baby deliveries have the highest viewership. My Kitty's response was unexpected when a fan questioned if she was compensated for this kind of work. Do you receive payment for activities such as documenting your births? I would hope so. A supporter questioned Tony and my Kelty. Technically, Jenny, I'm afraid not, she retorted. The reality star didn't go into further detail with her remarks. Gwendolyn Brown, one of her siblings, asserted on her YouTube channel that the elder sibling's criticism of them has angered Cody, Mary, Janelle, Christine, and Robin Brown. Beatriz Cueros, Gwendolyn's wife, stated, she does get some influence when she gets angry calls from some family members. She did not go into additional detail, though. The Duggar family continues to be one of the most notorious examples of reality kids who won millions of dollars but never saw a penny of the payoff. The family spent 17 years on television as the stars of the TLC series Jill and Jessa. Counting on, counting on, 17 kids and counting, 18 kids and counting, and 19 kids and counting. Jill Duggar who is the daughter of one of TLC's most successful families, speaks out against her parents in the prime video Shiny Happy People. She admitted that neither she nor her siblings received any compensation for their participation on the show. I never received any payment, not even a check or cash. I was never compensated in the first seven and a half years of my adult life, Jill stated. She further stated that none of her siblings received comparable pay. The Here Comes Honey Boo Boo Ensemble was another reality group that was extremely wealthy during its heyday. The two-year-long series was a TLC success. According to reports, June Shannon intended to show her daughters how to manage money by being wise with their reality TV money. According to reports, she invested their money in trust funds for their future. I want my children to look back and remember that their mother was wise. June told TMZ. I'm not like those other reality television stars. TLC deposits the funds for me into the daughter's trust accounts. I receive an email that details how much everyone receives. Sister Wives stars Cody, Mary, Janelle, Christine, and Robin Brown earn between $25, $40,000 per episode, per the U.S. Sun. The money at first reportedly went into a combined family account the five adults had access to. This would mean that for each season, which typically runs from 12 to 16 episodes, the family earned anywhere from $300,000 to $400,000. However, since splitting from three of his four wives, that payout now goes into four different LSCs. Cody and Robin Brown share their company, D-A-B-S-A-R-K, while the other wives are paid individually for their time on the series. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.